been long awaited. This is Chubby Soda. I say soda, but soda's not really actually on the front of it. Now, is it made with real cane sugar? This is the Rock and Roller Cola. So I think I have seven different flavors of these. I'm not sure how many they make. They are 250 milliliter or 8.25 fluid ounce little bottles. I think they're called chubby because they are these short little bottles. Uh, I think this is going to be the most normal of the flavors. Some of them are pretty pretty out there. We'll start with this to see, you know, can they can they make a cola? Can they can they pull off something basic like that? So let's see. I believe this has some, it's in some way intended for children. So maybe it's like a more health conscious. I mean, I certainly hope it would be. Let's see. Everything is in English and Spanish. Chubby Kids <laughs> ChubbyKidsClub.com is the website. Okay. 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 What else can I ascertain from this? This is a product of Trinidad and Tobago. I guess that's why it's also in Spanish. That's, uh, different. Chubby Bottle Design is a registered trademark of the company that makes this. Alright, I've read you enough dumb shit from the bottle. Now let's check out what the Chubby Rock and Roller Cola is all about. I believe all of them are clear bottles. They are, uh, most of them are red cap, but some of them aren't. But they are all clear plastic bottles, so I don't think I need to pour this into a glass. It might also be insulting to the soda if I put it in a glass and it's just the bottom of the glass, so. I really have no excuse not to finish these. <laughs> so, this is carbonated. As a question, by the way. It's definitely got a lot of spice to it for a cola, which is fine, but there's, aside from that spice, there's no real bite. It's very fleeting. It tastes kind of flat, and you heard it when I opened it, but it somehow it tastes flat already. I'm not sure how, how it's tasting flat this quickly. Uh, but flavor-wise, it's really good. Let's go ahead and finish it. Yeah, if you, if you were to drink the whole thing real quick, it's definitely got a bite to it. But aside from that, I don't, there's not really a lot of carbonation to it. Which, I mean, I guess maybe that's just not a big thing down south because all of the uh, Mexican Sprite, Mexican Coke, Mexican Fanta, they were all undercarbonated, in my opinion, compared to the, the traditional kind. Maybe that's the, you, I wonder, is the corn syrup helping it be carbonated and the cane sugar making it less carbonated? That is something to consider. Trying to find the date on here. There it is. It's uh, clear on clear. Alright, so it's best by December 22nd. Which is fine. <clears throat> and whenever it's undercarbonated, I have to check. Did I wait too long to drink this? Is it my own fault? So, I got six more of these. They are at one of the food stores near me, has a big cooler of them right at the self-checkout. And the other branch of that food store does not have any that I found. I found seven flavors total in there, and then it was like a three for, I forget what they cost. 
they were cheap. They were really cheap. And I wind up with two extras. So hopefully I like them. That'll be... They're sitting down there. The rest are in the fridge getting cool. That is the chubby rock and roller cola. What have I done with my life? I don't know. I'm considering this the soda that I'm reviewing. Thank you for watching. Let me know what the most recent crazy soda you've had is. You, what you've had is.